judges are Dalby Shirley, Joe Swessel, and Charles Minker. The referee is Harry Kraus. A feature traction of the afternoon, 12 rounds of boxing for the North American Boxing Federation Welterweight Championship. Introducing, in the red corner, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, a veteran of 43 professional fights, Andy Hawk Price. And in the blue corner, undefeated in 24 professional bouts, the North American Boxing Federation welterweight champion fighting out of Palmer Park, Maryland at 146 pounds, Sugar Ray Leonard. Introduction. Now, two things about Bryce's facial hair. One, it can cushion the blows, provide an effective protective cover. Two, in clinches, that hair can cause cuts on the opponent's face and maybe trouble the eyes. The bell for the start of action in round one. Price is seventh rank, beat Palomino in 74, Cuevas as recently as 76. Price is 25, will be 26 in November. Sugar Ray, as I said, 23. Ten-point must system of scoring. Now watch Price. He's a left hooker. In Los Angeles, he has great support. He is owned by the singer Marvin Gaye. Those of you not familiar with this man, they call him the Hawk, the uncrowned welterweight champion. So Sugar Ray should be in for a tough fight. The right kind of fight to have when later in the fall he's to face... Wilfredo Benitez for the title. Now you saw that right of Price's. It's a kind of floating right. It is not a powerful right. It's a winding right. What Leonard must do to prevail is keep that left working into the Price face because Price can be hit with the right. There was the quick Leonard jab. Scoring 10-point must system, mandatory eight count on knockdowns, no standing eight counts. Three knockdown rule is in effect. Can't be saved by the bell except in the final round. 19 foot, six and a half inch ring. Good start. So there are the bases. Referee. Is the veteran Harry Krause, no voice in the scoring, scoring by three judges. Dalby Shirley, Charles Maker, and Joe Swesson. We are almost two minutes into round one. Fighters feeling each other out. This fight for the North American Boxing Federation welterweight title. Leonard getting those swift jabs in there. That's what he must do. There, you see that? Set him up beautifully for the right. Got the jab in, doubled up on it, and then the right. That's the right lead, which Leonard specializes in, as Ali did for so many years. And Price against the ropes, suddenly killing Leonard's blows. And Leonard with much better power than he's given credit for. Hitting him with combination upon combination. Andy Price in trouble. And Leonard with his arms up raised the first knockdown of the fight. And it came with the round coming to its end. He will not get up. What a stunning victory. 